What's up ladies, welcome back to my channel. Today for you I have top six foundations. I'm super excited because the foundation is a pretty important step, we can all agree to that. Um, I don't know if you guys know this about me, but I'm a cosmetologist, so I'd like to think I know a thing or two about beauty, hair, and makeup, and all that good stuff. So, if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, give your girl a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe, hit that little bell so you guys are notified every single time I post a video. And without further ado, if you want to see what my top six favorite foundations are, then just keep watching. So, I've divided these up into well, three categories, which I don't know if this is accurate on what the packaging say. This is just my experience. I have full coverage, I have ones that I wear like more like daytime, and then I have um, like medium buildable coverage, so in between. The sheer like day-to-day -day coverage that I normally wear, and I wouldn't even call this sheer. This is the It Cosmetics CC Cream. I have this in the bronze, the illuminating, I have it in every one. This is amazing, you guys. Um, it's SPF 50, and I just feel like you can never have enough sunscreen. This just protects you from getting wrinkles and, okay, I'm not trying to look old and haggard real quick, okay? This helps with all that. So anyways, this really, really helps with fine lines and wrinkles because you're protecting yourself from the sun. It is not gonna remove them, but it will protect you from getting new ones, if that makes any sense. I also um, will show you guys in the future, but I have a spray that I use over my makeup. It's a setting spray that has SPF in it. Let me know if you guys are interested in seeing information on that. But I love this stuff. It's definitely, I, I would say it's full coverage, fuller coverage, um, but it's hydrating. So I feel like I could use this during the day. And like I said, it has SPF. So I think you get everything in one. Also, my color for um, this one, I'm in tan for the IT Cosmetics CC Cream. Okay, then this is more of like a splurge item. You definitely, this is, I don't even know if it says what coverage it is. Soft fluid long wear foundation. I don't use this every day. Um, this is a product that has SPF 20 in it. It's lighter coverage. I do have to build it up, but it's def, it's beautiful for daytime. Like it's so pretty and it definitely has an illuminating effect to it. It doesn't have like sparkles or glitter or anything like that but it just has like a glow from within look so i really really like this honestly sometimes i will mix these two together and um i really like the finish that it gives if you want a more natural look okay for the la mer i am in suede 33. i have this category which is more of like the medium coverage this is cover effects cover effects is known for their covering tattoos and covering things so this is it's got a natural finish and i think that's why i put it in this category not that it's not full coverage but it's more natural it's not as matte so i feel like the more natural uh, finishes i feel like don't seem as full coverage to me i don't know if that makes sense to anybody else but um i really like this it's beautiful on the skin it's lightweight and you can definitely build on it so cover effects this is really really good oh i'm not telling you guys what colors i'm in this is g50 Okay, your girl's kind of tan, so. All right, next is my tried and true. I mean, this is like, I'd have to say this is my OG number one, probably I've used forever, makeup forever, um, foundation. And I'm in the color Y405, but this is, this just always looks good on film and in camera and in photos. I feel like people ask me like, what foundation were you wearing? This is usually probably the one over the years, I should say, people have asked me. So I love this foundation. It's not as full coverage as some of the other ones that I have, but it is pretty full coverage and you can build on it. So, and it's light, it's liquid, so it's not um, too cakey or anything. The consistency is good is what I'm trying to say. So I really like this one, but Make It Forever Y405. Then, Okay, this is also one of my favorite ones. Now, this is very full coverage, and it I use this on a photo shoot. I did a photo shoot with the girls from Bachelor in Paradise. It was so much fun, and they loved this stuff. I put this on them, and it just looks really, really good in pictures. This is seven shade 7.0. This is all-nighter, waterproof, long-wear, liquid foundation. This stuff is thick, so you have to use a wet, damp beauty blender and work, work, work. You gotta work it into your skin, but I absolutely love this. 
and it is for sure full coverage. If I want to look like flawless in pictures, I use this. I love it. As well as this one. So getting into my next one is my double wear. These two are like, I want like full, full, full coverage, not see anything through my skin. These are the two that I'll use. The double wear Estee Lauder. I am honey bronze in this one. And if I had to choose which one, I probably would choose the double wear. I mean, I love this one, but if I had to choose one, I feel like this is my all-time favorite. This is the only foundation I've ever, besides the HD, because I've used that a longer amount of time, but more recently, I've gone through a whole bottle of this, which that's absurd to me because I have so much makeup, so to actually go through a bottle, that shows you how much I actually like it. But double wear, this is like my tried and true, tested. If I had to pick one out of all of these, I'm going double wear. Even for during the day, whatever, if I could only choose one, because you can add oil or moisturizer or whatever, and you can make it lighter. But this is, this is my baby. Mm -hmm. I love this stuff. So anyways, I stay double wear. This is matte, this is full coverage, full glam coming at your way. All right, ladies, I hope you guys enjoyed that top six foundations video. I will be posting more videos like this in the future. So if you're into beauty, give me a thumbs up, let me know. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe and that bell. You wanna get notified every time I post a video. So thank you guys for stopping by. I'm always your girl, Lorna Marie. Bye.